Ages, forests covered large areas of England, and wood was used for many purposes. This peasant, who is called Weedo, is carrying home a log for his fire. On most days, he'd be working with his family on these strips of land. His cousin Garth is already hard at work hoeing. There were three common fields in the village. crops were grown in two of them, and the third was left fallow. A different field was left fallow each year. This fallow field was manured by grazing cattle and sheep on it. This is a model of Weedow's house. At night, the family and their animals sleep on the floor. The dog will warn them if wolves or other enemies approach. A hall built of rough logs, like this model, was often the home of the Lord of the Manor, who ruled the village. The only other large building was the church. On certain days, Weedo goes with the other peasants to the Lord's land to work. They will not get any money for this, as it's a way of paying for their common rights. The Baron, who lives in this castle, rules over many villages and obeys only the King. Large areas of England are ruled by the church, and the baron's place is filled by the abbot. distributed to the sick and needy. This was a duty of the medieval church. This is the ruin of Porchester Castle, built in the 11th century. As well as castles, remains of the great monastic houses are found in every part of Britain. Some of them are still used as churches. Peasants helped with building but the skilled work was done by craftsmen from other parts of the country, or sometimes from abroad. For the peasants, this was a feudal obligation. Thank you. 
People are still arriving from the outlying parts. Fairs such as this were usually held in one of the larger villages. A crowd is collected to watch the juggler. There are many entertainers and many things to buy or exchange on such an occasion. As the day ends, some of the villagers set off for home before it gets too dark to see their way through the woods. Others remain to dance late into the evening before returning to the monotonous tasks which made up the lives of most people of medieval England.